We don't even know what we're doing anymore. Put my hands. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, you yeah, good, good plan. Look at that. Oh. <laughs> Guys, uh, it has been a while, and welcome back to another Poor Boys Racing video. But I just want to put out a quick little update video and kind of say where we've been and where everybody's been, what what we've been doing. Matt and Matt have been super busy as well. Matt Parsons is building a house right now, so he's been super busy with that and. He did sick week as the previous video showed. Uh, then Matt Tolleson, they had a baby back in January. So he's been super busy with that baby boy. And so, you know, I've been busy with the family as well. Uh, Eliza's growing up pretty quick. So a lot has just been going on. I lost my grandfather back in February. And things just, I didn't feel like making any videos. So I'm back, we're back. And we'll probably try to get back out to maybe one video a week, one video a month. Uh, I also went to day shift, so I'm not living that night shift life anymore, but we are going to do more car stuff as much as we can as you know, it's hot outside. We're trying to get it done inside and, uh, maybe we'll make it to the track anyways. So as far as that goes, so I put the motor in to try to figure out some stuff. I bought a turbo kit that I still might use. Don't know. Might use partial, might use part of it and uh, modify it to where it will work. <clears throat> I've been busy working on the wiring harness. I haven't really filmed anything, just been super busy. I've got the dash cut, not finished cut, but it's cut enough to get in the car and uh, fit up and test fit some stuff. So like I said, I've been running the wiring, trying to get the body harness done first and then the dash harness engine bay harness and the headlights and stuff like that so anyways we have all been super busy and haven't really had time to get together uh pretty much last time we got to get the last time we got together was for the jeep and uh that was pretty much it we we haven't done a whole lot of stuff that we filmed matt got his lift put up i sold the open car trailer and i bought drew's trailer which i'll i'll show you guys here shortly um i built the shed i don't know life's just been moving along trying to keep busy uh eliza is now 11 months old and she's almost walking so she's definitely keeping me and Brittany busy and uh garrett is right behind him right behind her so i'm sure he'll be super busy with that but we will get together. We will do some more car stuff. Uh, if you don't know, the Fairmont is up for sale. I put it up for sale on Facebook a couple weeks ago. And <clears throat> so recently I got AC put in my garage. I did that last weekend. That is, makes it so much nicer in here. It's about 72 degrees in here. And I've been working on the motor. And uh, I just have to tidy up a little bit to that. I don't think we've really done a whole lot. I don't think we've really put out a whole lot of what, what I've done on it, but it is almost done. I need to go ahead and order a converter and uh, that's kind of been a hold up because that's a very expensive part of this whole build. So once I get a converter, I can put the trans in and uh, get a shifter, wire the car, and uh, it won't be too far. So. The goal, uh, the goal is right now is to have this thing started up by the end of the year, even if it's without a turbo kit, just all motor, just get it cranked up, get some motivation behind me to finish the turbo kit, to finish everything. But hearing that engine run will definitely help motivate me. Like I said, this, like I said, this car is gonna be a full interior. There'll be carpet here. Um, I probably need to get a radio uh, other than the, the stock radio. The stock radio kind of sucks. It doesn't have AC, but the controls are gonna stay there. I got a little quick disconnect and the uh, steering wheel from Motion Raceworks in there. That way you can get in and, eat, in and out easier with the, uh, with the cage now. So I don't know what else to say. Let's go check out the trailer. And I bought Drew's enclosed car trailer. I helped Drew do a little bit of the work in here getting this 
getting this trailer ready, race ready. I didn't do a whole lot, but I helped him do some uh, wiring on the lights. And uh, so we got some E-Trek here, toolbox, uh, an oxygen tank. It's uh, it's definitely set up ready to race. It's got a, uh, came with a lot of tools. So shout out to Drew for hooking your boy up. Anyways, this is a uh, is an eight and a half by twenty four foot enclosed trailer, and uh, it's kind of what I plan on racing out of in the mock. And uh, I mean, the the mock is going to be the mock is going to be uh, set up for drag and drive. But I really originally built the car because I wanted I wanted to list race a eight six four street car list race. So uh, do some list racing. I don't know. That's the fun no time stuff we do down here in uh, upstate South Carolina. So anyways, uh, just picked up a generator. So that'll power the, the trailer. But uh, I look forward to racing next year. So get the car started up, get a big push and uh, get the turbo kit done. And maybe, you know, February, March, whenever the tracks open back up, we can get out there and get some testing done and uh maybe right and race next season so that is the goal that's the update for now uh i'll probably get over to matt's house one day here soon and we'll film some content show you guys his lift welcome to, welcome to tallison performance What's this thing in the shop again for, huh? Huh? What's this thing in the shop Dude, again just for? Dude, every Mustang week, I told you I got to take the transmission out, rebuild it, and put it back in. <laughs> and then scramble to get it to actually work for my vacation. Oh, Love man. Love it. It's good we don't start working on it until two weeks before. That's right. You know, crunch time. Anyways, I made a video yesterday. I you talked made about, a video? I made a, a video. YouTube video. I know. And kind of was talking about, I'll catch up with you guys. And I wasn't sure when I was going to. I, so I will catch up with you here. six months later when we finally make another it, video. It was He's yesterday. Like, He's waiting on us to stop being fat. <laughs> yeah, no. We're yeah, look, good look. There's, like, we're about to start these OnlyFans. Ha half a Parsons and half a Tollison. Welcome back to the channel. So we were too fat for YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> now we look good. Our ratings are going up. So I was telling about, uh, I was talking about Garrett and yeah, kind of talking about different, you know, where since... February, where have we been? Is that the last you know, video was February? Was like first or second day of, of sick week. So well, I told people that we just didn't have a YouTube channel anymore. They asked me. <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, I don't know what it is anymore. You know, all the stuff's changed. So, hey, Garrett, he's six months now, almost seven yeah. months. Put in a lift, so there's that. Yeah, we had, we had the lift. I, I okay. don't know if that ever made it to the well, channel, we, but, but we, uh, we filmed the, for it. Cut the ceiling out. So cut the ceiling out. Use it now. So. Yeah. Got a lift. It's official a toss. And started, started a house. And yeah, started a house. yeah I, I told him about your house. That's yeah. what I mentioned a little bit. So, yeah. figured I'd put a little bit of a, hey, guys, 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 Matt, Matt, Matt are still alive. This thing literally, all, we drove it for the first time last week, and it hasn't been drove since sick week. I yeah. pulled it out of the trailer. I was so pissed and just parked it. And that's why it's nasty. So you've hated the you've hated the YouTube channel as much as I oh, have. Yeah, no, I was, <laughs> no. I, I, I was angry. Some anger issues. It was a very expensive vacation. Are you mad? <clears throat> I'm not mad. Hey, Matt bought Matt bought Escalade. I don't know if that's made of the channel. Tur <laughs> tur turbo Escalade over here. You know that's not content worthy. Or so anything. no motorcycle. New no motorcycle. New motorcycle. Uh, you get the head studs. Uh. Yeah, and, that and some some motor, some motors being built over here. Too so old. we haven't stopped doing stuff. We just stopped filming stuff. Yeah, we just, don't we like just been too busy. Real busy. Yeah. So. All of a sudden. Anyways, we just wanted to kind of go over and. The car's got a new transmission in it. Car's got a new transmission. Second gear lead, baby. She she might go fast now. We don't know. She might got a little. Go, might even go fast on a poor surface. So that would be. Might even do some no prep no prep and stuff. No pricing. No pricing. I'm gonna no. to put these street tires in. You know, that's, no, that's, what, these, uh, that's what Mustang Week is for you, really. It's just a no prep. 
There is zero the preparation. <laughs> yeah, on everything, <laughs> the surface and the car. I might not even wash it before I go down there. You know, car, uh, car washes are cheap at Sphinx. It's only, yeah. it's only like seven bucks. I ain't got time for that. Anyway, so I just want to bring Matt and Matt back into the video and kind of just give us a little update on what we did is and what we've been doing. Is it camera or is it just our stomachs? Or what did it used to do? It's I mean, off, it's, our heads, our heads it's, off. Right. It's, it's on, just our stomachs. It's on point five right now. It's on the wide it's angle. It's backed out? It should have like the ceiling right now. Good. I'm See? just checking. I mean, we're rusty. We ain't done this in a while. I know. We don't even know what we're doing anymore. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> thanks for tuning my hands. <laughs> I don't punch him at punch Matt. Uh, Hit him in the balls. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, thanks for tuning in. We'll see you in the next one. Thank you. I appreciate your compliments. Good job. Look at Matt here. Big brain. Big brains. He, he's not, if only China man could have given me another six inches. Hey man, they're shorter than you. They are short. <laughs> they're they're big, big, big lips. Than I don't think they actually work on cars. I think they just don't want to <laughs> disposable vehicles. You need to try. You need to try. <laughs> I, I had a really big bug. <laughs> you can't turn it on. And... Yeah, we're about to try it on Taylor. Oh, it still works. Here, try it. <laughs> it's probably going to bust as soon as we. Woo! <laughs> I wasn't even pushing the button. That's, that's more. That's that cap it talked about. Hey, it said like what, 7,000 volts? It ain't 12 volts, it's 7,000. That's why it busted that light bulb. Did it blow the light bulb? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I think it definitely did. I don't think so. Check it. No, that's still good. I think. Yeah, it's still good. It just zapped it did for no reason. I changed my mind on the $50. That's <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, you, yeah, good, good plan. Look at that. Dude, that's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. Look at that. We could be like whistling diesel and accidentally. Oh! <laughs> Why is it so much more violent on that? It doesn't make any sense. Cause that's meant to dissipate I guess. the charge. Oh, yeah. yeah, this has a resistor. That's why. Makes sense. Hmm. Cheap. You won't do it on this. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Let me stand back. <laughs> You're done. <laughs> <laughs> now spray a little bit and do it. <laughs> what are you welding? Sounds like it. You big welding that bottle. Ah! <laughs> oh. Kill the batteries on this thing. Well, it did work. <laughs> you killed it? Oh. <laughs> it still got some. Here, come here, come here. <laughs> I'm out. <laughs> <laughs>